it was brought to the attention of the College Academic Council from students that they really wanted a consistent look and feel for their Blackboard courses and also for what's posted on, Bla on Blackboard in terms of information that they required. Uh, a compromise was made and AA42 is that compromise. As faculty, we're requested, to, we're requested and, and encouraged and required to post our course information, um, our contact information, course section information, that's a breakdown of our weekly planning, uh, all assignments for students so that they can plan their, their journey. Uh, your course outline should all be done before classes begin. Throughout the course, announcements, any change in room um, um, should be posted. Your content should be posted. Your grades need to be posted and uh, updated consistently. In a hybrid course, please ensure that you're, you've got an explanation of, explanation of how your in-class and out-of-class relates to one another so students understand why it's so important to complete their online tasks. In order to create a successful mobile learning environment, I encourage you to have a programmatic approach. Sit down with the other faculty in your program, determine what the best look and feel for your program is going to look like, and have a consistency in your Blackboard. Make sure that students can go onto each Blackboard in your program and see the same material posted uh, in each course. They don't have to relearn Blackboard every time they go on. The second most important thing to do is ensure that students really know how you're going to use mobile learning in your class. Determine amongst the faculty who's going to do what in their course. Some might be great with social media, some might be not so great with technology, but might want to use one specific thing throughout their course. Come to an agreement and let your students know first day. That's really important for the students to know. If you're going to use it for a specific day, let them know. They can bring in their laptops when they ordinarily don't have to and can learn successfully. Finally, enjoy your uh, mobile learning device. Play with it. Enjoy it. If you enjoy it, your students will. Have fun.